so today I'm gonna do my everyday makeup routine for you. This is not like absolutely, like, I don't wear my makeup like every single day, but these are for the days when I actually do wear my makeup and I actually try to wear my makeup. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go wet my beauty blender. Okay, so I'm gonna start doing my makeup and I'm gonna show you guys like all the products I use. I might not like, I might speed it up, I don't know yet, but this is my, I start off with moisturizer and I use my Clinique Moisture Surge Moisturizer. This is, this is what it is. I don't like have an exact like, sorry, I don't have an exact name for it, but this is just what I do. Like, I don't do this makeup routine every single day, but like I don't do my makeup every single day, honestly. So now I wet my beauty blender. Actually, it's like real technique sponge. And I've been using the CoverGirl Healthy Elixir Foundation in the shade 725. And just so you know, it does look very light. It does, but when you, I like it for all it oxidizes. And because I've used it once and it like matched me fine. And after it oxidizes, like it starts to look actually like nice. So, you know, I know it looks very, very light. It is very, very light, but. I see it doesn't match right now, but I promise it starts to darken and then sorry I don't have like a full on mirror right now. Well it's annoying but whatever, okay. I'm gonna get my other side. first before I do anything. So I take the Kat Von D shade and light palette and I use this middle shade to set my under eyes. Um, I just shake, take this middle shade. And I know I didn't put any concealer on but I set them in the After that I take my Physician Formula Butter Bronzer and I just start to bronze my face to like match my neck more and my arms and chest after that I usually put brow gel on I use a um, Anastasia clear brow gel no, I do not fill my eyebrows, if anyone's wondering. I just never really got into that. I don't really need to fill my eyebrows in. I mean, I don't have like nice eyebrows by any means, but by any means, but I don't fill them in. I really don't need to. Then after that, what I usually do is I'll take, um, depending on how I feel, sometimes I curl my, curl my lashes, sometimes I'm like, eh. So I'm just taking this Revlon curler. And then I take my Maybelline Lash Sensational and I coat my eyelashes in them. This mascara is honestly the bomb. I used to use the Benefit Roller Lash, which I do have a backup of, but this works just as good and it's 20 times cheaper. Sorry if you hear that weird breathing, that's my cat. She's kind of fat. She's back there and I don't know if you guys can see her, but. I just had to do this because I need a hobby like honestly I don't do anything at school I think it's kind of boring so I think and honestly like my friend Maris helped inspire me to do this like so oh mm, okay now I'm going to go for highlighter but first I'm gonna like set my face Sorry, I'm, oh, and I'm using the Myra Budescu um, Cucumber Spray. I don't have, I had, had the rose one too, and I really want to try the uh, the lavender one. Girl, you're killing it, killing the game. I'm just kidding, but happens. Okay, so now for highlighter, I use the Morphe 510 brush, and for highlighter, I like the Ofra or Deo Dry And mine broke, like the packaging broke. Then maybe today I'll use something different. Yeah, you know what? Today I'll use something different. I'll switch it up. So, but this is my favorite. 
But today I use um oh I use Laura Gelder's Laura Gelder's Laura Gelder's Gelded Honey. This is a wicked pretty highlighter too. Like it's so nice. And I also spray my brush afterwards because. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, girl. Okay, it's kind of like too much for my liking. Oh, no, it's not. It's actually not that bad. I might look a lot worse on camera though, so I don't really know. I might, yeah, I might look. I might be thinking, oh my god, this is so nice, and on camera like, ooh, but it's fine. Oh, okay. Actually, this might be my new go-to because now I'm darker. I'm gonna put some on my nose. Since my lips are bare and I have nothing on them and they kind of look like butthole lips right now. Um, let's see what color I want to use. Usually I'll use, recently I've been using the Jeffree Star's Gemini, but I don't think I'm gonna use it for this because I'm really not wearing like anything dressy and like this sticks out like a sore thumb when you wear it. But it looks good with my tan, honestly, but like me. So I'm probably gonna take one of my, uh, cap on D liquid lipsticks and lighten it up a little bit. I think, I think today I'm gonna try Ludwig because I'm a little darker and it, it looks a little bit darker. We'll see how it looks. If it doesn't look good, I'll take it off, but. Oh, that's good, that's good. Trixie, go. Sorry you guys, my cat's in the, try to get in. Oh, and I've also been loving liquid lip, uh, lip gloss. Ooh, I like, ooh, I really like this. Kind of wish it was like, not so cool toned, but. <laughs> Fine. But anyways, this is my everyday makeup routine and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And this is like how it's finished. Um, if you guys wanna see more videos, like, Actually, like, leave comments about like what kind of videos you want to see because I really need like I'm I think I want to vlog and stuff, but like I really don't know what to do for videos. So just like keep watching and leave me comments and questions actually because I do want to do like a Q and A. I think that'd be fun. So just comment down below what you think I should do and bye guys.